welcome back everyone. I'll go and show you exactly how to set up AirLink on your Oculus Quest 2. Now what this specific you know, option does is that it allows you to go ahead and pair your Oculus Quest headset to your PC completely wirelessly. And this is actually so awesome. Now you will have to make sure that your Wi-Fi connection is you know, really good. If it's not super you know, great, it may be a little choppy here and there. And you have to be on version 30 of your specific Oculus Quest you know, software. So as long as you're on V30, you should be good to go. If you're not, you wanna go ahead and make sure you update your specific software and you should be good to go at that point. Now at this point, you will also have to make sure on your PC that you have the Oculus PC application downloaded. This is pretty much the main way you're going to go ahead and connect to it. And as long as your PC and your Quest headset are set up you know, properly and they're also connected to the same Wi-Fi, well, you are pretty much good to go almost there. So what you wanna do on your PC, as long as you're on version 30 on your Oculus Quest headset, you wanna go ahead and you wanna open up the PC app for your Oculus application. On the left side of the application, you wanna go and click settings, and then you wanna go into the general tab. Now at this point, when you're in that app, you wanna scroll all the way to the bottom when you're in the general section, and you also wanna make sure you're on version 30 on that specific application. As long as you're on version 30 there, you are pretty much good to go. So at this point, all you wanna do here is you wanna go and click on the settings portion on that specific panel. You then wanna go and click on beta, which will be on the top right, you know, kind of corner. And you wanna go ahead and enable AirLink, which should be a little option that you have there. Now at that point, what you wanna do on your Quest headset, you, you wanna go and make your way over to your settings panel. You wanna click on settings again on the left side. You wanna scroll down to experimental features. And within that experimental features tab, you wanna click on AirLink. Now you are pretty much almost good to go. At this point, you wanna go ahead and launch into your Oculus PC software on your PC. And then on your headset, you wanna go ahead and click on the system clock that's in the menu bar, and you wanna open up quick actions page. Now you wanna also, on the left side of the quick actions page, you wanna click on Oculus AirLink. It'll be a little button there. And there it's going to ask you what the requirements are, whatever you wanna click next. And then it's going to allow you to see the available computers around you. At that point, you wanna find the computer that's you know for your PC, and you wanna go ahead and click pair. Now it may tell you to type in a code and you may have to type in a code from your PC there. And that is really pretty much it. Once you've successfully typed in that code, you are pretty much good to go. And that's all you have to do as of this point. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love it. every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.